Hi everyone, welcome back to Vlogmas, day number 20 I think for you. It is actually the 20th of December today, Wednesday. Um, so when you're watching this, this just happened earlier on today. Um, I didn't do any recording yesterday. Um, I usually do this towards the end of December, start to um, record and release on the same day. And that's just because I like Christmas Eve to be the same day. So. I just had a little break yesterday, it was nice. Um, I got on with my um, crochet project that I need to do and some other bits that were very boring, so you didn't miss much. Um, so, today's the Wednesday the 20th. Last night I went to bed incredibly early. For the last two nights, Oscar's been going to sleep at like half past five, six o'clock. And, um, it just shows how tired he actually is for going to sleep really, really early. Um, like I said in the last vlog or the vlog before, that they are usually are finished by now. This time last year, we were chilling out watching Christmas films and doing Christmas activities, but they are still going to school. Today is Oscar's Christmas um, jumper day. So he just needs to get dressed now. He's just laying here on the sofa all wrapped up. I don't know why he's so sleepy this morning, because he's had about 12, 13 hours sleep. Anyway, I'm going to um, That's really amazing. get Oscar dressed. Persuade him to get dressed. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, so today is uh, not much of anything, to be fair. I need to wrap some presents, but I think I'll do that tomorrow. Um, I've got all the adults to wrap. So I need to do that at some point. And then I think I've decided to do my Christmas food shop on Friday morning after the school run. So I think Oscar's going to my dad's. So then I can do when? that Thursday night. Just tomorrow. Yeah. And you're going to, you're staying here, you're going to school on Friday. Maisie's trying to uh, get in the vlog again, as per. No, 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 Hi everyone, I got back from the school run. It started to rain, which is not ideal. I wanted to take Maisie for a walk. I'm just going to wait until it stops and take her around the block. I can't take her to the woods. It will be too muddy up there. Um, and I just washed all my cushion, um, cushion covers, um, blankets and stuff that I put on the sofa to keep the sofas nice and stuff. And I've just washed them and they're literally drying here. And if I took her to the woods, no doubt her dirty little feet would go on them. And then, um, yeah, I'd have to wash them again. So I'm doing all like, um, uh, well, the Christmas cleaning, but little odd jobs. Like I'm doing this um, uh, seat cover next. So that's going to go in. Um, I'm going to clean all the uh, cushion covers and stuff in there. And um, yeah, it's just like little, little cleaning jobs that I'm doing. I don't want to do the big clean because um, because it would just get messy again by Christmas. So I'm planning to do that on Saturday. So Saturday is going to be quite a busy day for both me and Mark. I've got some business to do like, um, well, I've got the cleaning to do, but I've got um, things like wrapping to do. A lot of wrapping needs to be done. I'm doing that on Saturday. Mark is going out with his grandma. Um, he's going to do her Christmas shopping with her and to the graves. So he visits his granddad and parents' graves and um, puts, um, you know, flowers down and all that jazz for Christmas. And um, so he'll be out pretty much all day. And also at some point this week or Saturday, depending on um, how long his days are at work, he needs to do a job for my dad. Um, it's a really funny story, actually. It's, it, it makes me laugh. My dad's TV broke and he was like, oh, I need a new TV. 
I am considering 70 inch and I was like that's massive that's huge 70 inch tellies are huge and he was like oh well mine's 65 and I was like no it's not it's, it's a lot smaller than 65 Mine's like 50 and his is slightly bigger. So I was like, it must be like 55, 60 at most, at very most. Anyway, so he decided to buy this telly in the same size as his current telly. And 65 inch that he believed, but I was like, it's definitely not. Anyway, it arrived the other day and he said that it <laughs> was delivered. And he was like, oh my God, this is not, my telly is not 65 inch. This is massive. Um, so yeah, I was like, no one listens to me. No one takes my advice. I told you it wasn't 65 inch. Anyway, he wants to put it in his window uh, sill seat thing. He's got like a little bay window and he wants to put it there. But the current, uh, the feet on this thing, they're wide, they're not in the centre, they're wide on each side and it just doesn't fit just slightly. So he needs to extend his window seat out a little bit to put it on top. He currently has nowhere to put it. He doesn't have a like a, a cabinet or anything to put it on. And um, he can't put it on the wall because the brackets of the old telly won't, won't handle 65 inch. So, well, maybe not handle 65 inch, but it's, it's massive anyway, this telly. So he needs help to buy some wood, cut it down, extend his window seat just slightly um, for this TV to fit on. But it made me laugh. It makes him laugh as well. He, he said that the truck arrived and they're pulling out this massive box and he, as soon as he saw this box, he was like, well, I've made a mistake here. My telly must be 55. And I was like, I don't think, no one listens to me. No one listens to me. Anyway, Mark has to do this job for him and uh, we don't know what Mark is going to be working over the next couple of days so he may be able to get there after work one day and help him with this job or it might be a Saturday job because my dad needs it done before Christmas because currently this massive TV is just sat on the floor. I'm just doing the Christmas cleaning tasks on Saturday. Busy day. I like it to be nice and chilled for Christmas Eve for the first time in years because Christmas Eve can be quite stressful for me um but this year I think it's going to be nice and chill because I'm going to get I am going to get everything done on Saturday the Christmas shop happens on Friday so I'll have all the food in um I don't have to leave the house really on Christmas Eve I might go and visit my mum but other than that I don't have to do anything um yeah a nice chilled out day Christmas Eve hi everyone it is much later now. I'm just about to go on the school run in 10 minutes. Um, I've had to change my clothes because that really high neck um, jumper I was wearing is irritating me. So you can see where I've scratched here. Um, yeah, I've had to take one of Mark's strong antihistamines because it's still irritating me even though I've taken it off. So um, hopefully that will work. <laughs> anyway, I have... What have I done today? I've done loads of things. I've um, finished my crochet projects. Really? Honestly, every time. <laughs> every time she comes. Um, I finished my crochet projects. I took the Maisie out for a little walk. It stopped raining briefly. I think it's raining again. Very heavy winds out there today. Um, raining on and off and um, winds um, I think a, there's a storm coming I think it's in the east though so um, yeah I've done I finished my crochet projects now so they're done I had lunch I had a bacon sandwich took Maisie for a walk uh, potted around uh, put my washing out to dry put all the covers back on the sofas things like that I um didn't think of picking up the camera. I should have, but I didn't think of picking up the camera, which is random, but that's what I've done this afternoon anyway. So 10 minutes away, I'm going to go collect uh, the kids from school. So that's what I'm going to do. And then I don't know what I'm going to do for the rest of the evening, edit this vlog for one. And um, I don't know, have dinner. 
<laughs> don't know. There's nothing going on today. So I'm back from the school run now with the dog as per usual. Getting as close as ever. Um, yeah, Oscar was telling me that all he did all day was play games. I don't know why they bother sending us on the last few days of school. <laughs> They're not actually doing any work. They're just playing games and having fun. No, I played games in the afternoon. All right, so half the day. What did you do in the morning? Did you do maths and English? All that I needed to do. No. So maybe I've learnt something. Um, tomorrow's going to be completely nothingness because the last day is always them just doing um fun things all day, isn't it? Um, <sighs> she's perching on me. Look at her. She's watching outside for birds and cats and stuff anyway i don't know what to say i don't know what to say i don't know what to do it's all very boring stuff isn't it maybe what can i do <laughs> what can i do um i might put on a film mark's at work still he'll be finished soon i expect and i'm wondering what whether it's the best day to send him to do I'm wondering whether it's the best day to send him to my dad's to do that um, shelfy thing that he needs to do because Oscar wants to go to Grandad's anyway to pick up his... What did you want? Tiddlywinks. He wants tiddlywinks to take him to school tomorrow because apparently they're allowed to bring their own stuff. So that's what he wants. Fair enough. Anyway, I am going to go for now and I'll see you in a bit. Hi everyone, I am doing my editing, so I thought I'd come on and just say hi. Um, Oscar was saying that he's got a bit of a sore throat and earache, and Mark rang and said he's got a sore throat. He's on his way home from work, so he just rang to say he's on his way and that he's got a sore throat. So, yet another bug has struck the house. I thought, after this month, with Oscar in particular, he's had like three different illnesses, he was sick, he had that cough and cold, and then he was sick everywhere. And now he's got a sore throat and earache, and so has Mark. So yet another bug has come into the house. And it's difficult really, because just before Christmas or even on Christmas, one of my children have to have some sort of illness or I have to have a cold or an illness. So it's typical, isn't it? Um, so I've given Oscar some cowpole, hopefully that will settle it for the time being and then we'll just keep an eye on him. And um, yeah, I haven't even started tea yet, it's half past four, um, it's going dark and um, well it is dark, <laughs> it's dark now. So it's the longest day, to, uh, longest day, shortest day tomorrow, um, my dad's birthday actually. Um, so yeah, the 21st shortest day so yeah it's very much dark now and it's only half past four anyway yeah so i just thought i would come on i have to um i'm filming editing and releasing on the same day so all my vlogs are going to be later than usual um probably like eight nine o'clock probably from for the next few days five more days to go though so <sighs> not long anyway I am going to go for now. I will see you in a bit when I have made tea. I don't know what we're having. Do you know what I really fancy? Fish and chips from the chip shop. Who votes fish and chips from the chip shop? Anyway, I'm going to go for now. I will see you in a bit.